Tyson Fury is brilliant at switch uh, fighting out of orthodox and, and south. Switch, right? Switching stance, yeah. Which which obviously confuses a lot of his opponents, and they're they're not used to him being fighting a fighter that is equally as good right or left handed. The thing that has, has a, surprised me tonight is how much Tyson Fury is confused with Francis Ngannou yeah. out of a southpaw yeah. stance. Well, Ngannou's been doing what Fury does, switching orthodox southpaw, orthodox southpaw, but he's probably better He's holding the, the centre. He's he... holding the centre of the ring. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? Oh, mate, you just can't write this. He's holding it. Wow. Fury can push him back. He's a big, strong unit. He's 19, 20 yeah, stone. Yeah, but he's getting he clipped whack. there, John. He's getting clipped. This is... I've got to be honest, boys, right? Who's winning this round, by the way? I don't know. Close. It's not a it's close it? round. Maybe just Fury. I don't know. A few it's... more jabs flicking in his face. It's... I don't know. But this some is... judges don't just think, like, they don't really count. That, like, if there's nothing no. on the end of the jab, they're not really... Yeah. They like the big shots, aren't they? They're yeah. professional judges. This... That's a good jab. Listen, I was... That's I... it. Keep it. <sighs> Keep it there. At the, I can imagine in about three and a half minutes time, He's winning this round, Fury. I'm going to have to throw an apology out here, right? Because... I, I was genuinely it's a close down. fight, man. I was, so was I. Mate, I was down on the fight. I was like, what is this? So was I. This, this has been an entertaining fight. This has been more entertaining than watching Tyson Fury I, against Terry Chisora. I totally agree. A million percent. Right, wow. boys, we've got 10 seconds left in round nine. Yeah. A round that has gone very close. I'm going to level this round, round off. Are you going to go Fury round? Fury round for me. Right, so we go Fury round. I'd agree. It's a fury okay. round. It's got right, to so this is where I we're agree, at, boys. I agree, I this agree. is where we're is at. It's all to play for. So I'm writing the scores down. <laughs> Are we level going into the last round? We've got it level going oh, into man. the last round. Nah, We've got it level going into the last round, boys. This is oh. this is it. The WBC heavyweight champion of the world <laughs> against the UFC former heavyweight champion having his first professional boxing match. We've got it all level going into round 10. Should Mate. he give him his belt? It, I know that it's not on the line. Oh, my days. I can't believe I'm saying Should this. he give him his belt? Is the belt not on the line? No, it's not on the line. Yeah, it's, uh, they've got a WBC special belt. Look at no, Usyk. No. Usyk's watching this going. I need to process all this. Oh, oh, and the only way to process this. <laughs> what is going on? Usyk is there thinking, hmm, okay. I'm licking his lips a little bit. Well, but... I think he might be a little bit nervous, mate, because... Mind you, does the fight still happen? Well, his WBC title's not on the line. It could be a rematch. It's an argument for a rematch, yeah? It, mate, it will be. Mate, there's nothing in this fight. This is absolutely... Come on, Fury. Crazy, man. Do it, man. Come on. This is... <laughs> <laughs> Just pull it out of the bag. There's nothing in it. This is... This, Gypsy this. King, come on. Wow. Wow. You've got to give kudos oh, to mate, Francis sake, and Gannon. Listen, you have, mate, but for the sake of boxing, we need Fury win here. Um, here we go. Three minutes remaining. Um, I think with one thing's for certain, I as well, I've underestimated Francis and Ganu. Well, I think everyone did. But everyone we, has. It's the not knowing anyway. No one knew what we was going to get, did we? But you're just going on the history, yeah. you know? And, it, you know, we've got to remember Tyson Fury is the best heavyweight of our era right now. You know? Take all that into consideration. Mate. Right, match Francis and Ganu. What? Daniel, De, Daniel Dubois versus Ngannou. How do you see that going? How do you see uh, Joshua oh. versus Ngannou now? On he's, this? He's finding himself right in the mix on with this. all them top he's guys. In the mix. What is he doing? This is crazy, man. He's ripped up the whole script and he's absolutely thrown himself in the mix. How do you think Ngannou does against Joshua? How do you think, think he... Ngannou does against Johnny Fisher? Yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> I'm going to say I'm going to knock him out of the round. <laughs> I still will. Uh, yes, exactly. Listen, yeah. right, we've got two minutes, right? This is tight. If you're Francis Ngannou now, you th I, I Mate, personally think you absolutely roll the go dice. Go for it. Roll it. Just windmill just, it in. Just win round the, the sides. Win push the him, rough him up, shoulders, elbows in. To be fair, for our listeners that can't see this, Tyson Fury is the one on the back foot. He's the yeah. one yeah. walking around the perimeter and of the judges, ring. And Ganu like is holding the centre. You hold the centre of the ring. That's a core thing that judges look for. Absolutely. And Ganu just switched southpaw as well. Mate. This is something Tyson Fury is not used to either. The, the awkwardness, the switching just of stance. That. Mate, what is... What, who's winning this one? It's what, nothing. This nothing's, nothing's, happening. Round. nothing's happening. Nothing's in it. Someone it's can nick this round just with a one-two or a, good a little, big shot. Yeah. A body shot even. Just something a little bit eye-catching will win this round. Look at Johnny. He's absolutely... I can't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, this is... No Eddie, Eddie, Eddie's absolutely been saying... Insane. Eddie's been saying I'm knocking and getting out in a round. <laughs> well, uh, maybe two. Uh, yeah, maybe, maybe two now. Maybe two. This is... Listen, nobody anticipated this. 
the whole uh, the, good Francis job, good job. absolutely has earned the respect. Yeah, but that ain't winning the round, John. That no, jab. Do you know what I mean? We're not. We're, we're I not think at if that I was a gunner, throw that loop in Tommy Morrison left hook right over. It. Bang. Fifty uh, seconds, man. Fifty seconds. That's to it, cheer. man. Last minute world. They've got go, to be shouting that in the corner now. Go, 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 yeah, do it. Good uppercut, good uppercut. Oh. Oh. Fury misses with a wild right and got him. Oh! oh. 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 Jumps. He went for a Superman punch. Oh my God. It's just Fury's timing Mate. looks a little bit out, doesn't it? For, for and Garnu done the Superman jump. I love it. I love it. He's got full MMA on it. He's gone Superman 10 punch. rounds with the heavyweight champ of the world. Mate, oh, he's, he's gone 10 he's rounds. It and he's, he's not loving it. He's, de- he's gone 10 rounds. Forget the result. He's gone the distance. Mate, the, he's done the listen, Rocky Balboa. He, he might have pulled off the biggest shock in heavyweight history. Go. Bigger than seconds. Mike Tyson versus Buster Mate, Douglas. This Tokyo is... 1990. I can't believe he's gone the distance. This is the maddest Mate, thing. Mate, uh, yeah, has he won it, John? Mate. Has he won it? Mate. I don't know. Oh, oh my God. There's what, nothing in it. I think they call it a draw. Oh, my days. Hold your breath. Hold your breath. We'll be back in a minute. Oh, wow. With the result. Right. Let's just try and uh, process what we have just witnessed. Um, it has just finished in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia, uh, where Tyson Fury and Francis Ngannou uh, have had a, a boxing uh, contest. And it was a boxing contest. Absolutely, Francis Ngannou has exceeded the expectations of every single person, absolutely myself, going into that fight I owe him a massive apology because my word the work that you have put in man to get to that level was I, absolutely I do top as well. class so do I um, from a Tyson Fury point of view did he put the work in listen this is, these are questions that are going to be asked to him in the aftermath of uh, all of this of course it feels um, an incredibly close fight of give which it to Fury I think Tyson Fury has his hand raised and he looks like he has been given the decision from what I'm hearing there, that might be a split decision because Tyson, because Francis Ngannou raised his hand at one particular point as well. I'll just try and get some comfort. Uh, 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 split split decision. decision. So we've had a split decision, a 95-94 Ngannou, a 96-93 Fury and a 95-94 Tyson Fury. Tyson Fury wins via a split decision. There are boos ringing around the arena in Saudi Arabia. Um... Listen, that was an incredibly close fight. I personally thought that Tyson Fury might just have edged those last two rounds when, obviously, Francis slowed down, gassed the touch. But right up until the eighth, there is absolutely no question that that was razor, razor That was a tight fight. Listen, that was a tight fight. It was subjective scoring that. It could have gone one way or the other. What was you looking at? The knockdown for me could have been... Could have been so important in the winning and losing of that contest. It's gone Tyson. The boxing gods were with Tyson Fury tonight because that was close, boys. That yeah. was very close. Absolutely. Thoughts, Johnny? Oh, just... Uh, I'm just thinking, for me, it's about how, how well Francis and Gannon done. That's all I'm thinking about. I've... Uh, I think all of us underestimated yeah, what he'd done there. I thought he shaped up lovely, holding the centre of the ring. He knocked Tyson Fury down. Do you know what? He knocked Tyson Fury down. Did I, Dillian White do that? No. Did no. Derek Chisora do that? No. It, but he, yeah, he, he, but he, made, he made life very difficult for Fury. Now, do you know what I want to do? Because obviously we're here and we're working the way that we're doing and we're keeping an eye on it. I want to go home, re-watch that again because that was yeah. razor tight, man. It was. And I still don't know what way that went. Do I you know that? Fury's jab came into it the second half of the, the fight, end, pinging yeah. it a little bit, and then judges look at that and they, they like that. Some judges don't just score it in that way, but he was starting to... Get, in, get into his rhythm a little bit. He's had a long time out the ring as well. I know we talk about Ngannou, but he's had, he didn't fight since Chisora last, last year. Listen, the facts are this. Tyson Fury's had his hand raised via a split decision in Saudi Arabia, but the star of the show by an absolute country mile is Francis Ngannou. He absolutely showed up tonight and showed that he can box. Going into this contest, I said Francis Ngannou has got one opportunity at the big time of boxing. I personally think he's just announced himself. There is an opportunity, if he wants, to maybe have a dance again in the boxing world. Yep. I'm sure there'll be a clamber for people wanting to see Tyson Fury and Francis Ngannou go at it again. Anthony Joshua comes into the conversation. Yeah. Very sort of big How does he do against that? How does he do against... No, nobody knows the answer. The world is your oyster, Francis Ngannou. Welcome to the party, my friend. The lunatics let you into the asylum and you absolutely ran wild I'm going to go home I'm going to process what I've just seen I'm going to have a good sleep and I'll come back tomorrow and a Chinese <laughs> with some uh, more considered thoughts a penny for the thoughts by the way of Alexander 
Busick. Thanks for listening. We'll catch you next time.